Yo, what up? I'm here with uh, I'm here with Meech Rat, and we're doing a COD tier list. Yes, sir. And um, yeah, all I can say yeah, is let's about, let's really get into man, it. We about to get straight into it. You feel me? Oh God, shit. I mean, I, I've been playing COD since COD Four, so we're starting from COD Four. We're not starting from the older ones. But uh, yeah, let's get into it. So uh, we're gonna start with COD Four. Alright, I, I personally think COD 4 was A tier. It wasn't the best. It was like bare bones. You know, best for us, really good for us. Should we go by his prime or should we go by. I think we should go by prime and like longevity wise, like how much uh, people played uh, it afterwards, too. S tier. S? It was the start of the great. S? The start of the great, yeah. Um. Uh, I mean, I okay, so huh. me personally, I do think it's I think it's pretty good S tier wise. No, I think is no, I think is I think it's a just because when World at War came out, you know, what I'm saying that was the cut after that, and World at War was competing with it really good. So, I mean, so yeah, A tier, all right. Cod World at War. World at War started zombies. Okay. Started yes, the path pathway to zombies. Um, multiplayer was pretty pretty good. Uh, I just didn't like me personally. I didn't like tanks. Like the tanks. I didn't like tanks. <laughs> the tanks. Um, the glitches. Not the glitches. Is right. The glitches. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Mostly the tanks. And the weapons was like in the map. What you think? Like, what you think? Uh, uh, high B A tier somewhere in that. B A. Yeah, somewhere in there. Uh. Oh, and we'll revise it before the video ends. All right. Yeah, I'll just put it on B. All, All right. right. Let's... After that, we got what? B O one. Yeah. Oh man, you know how I feel about this guy. Man, I love zombies. I love zombies. I love multiplayer. There was not really a lot of toxic shit in BO1. Legendary, the, the birth of Nuketown. Yep. S tier. Start li li listen, and started streaks. Started the streak system. Yep. Wait, no, wh where are we at? No, we're Wait. NW2. <laughs> Wait. NW2, Wait. yeah, oh. NW2, because look, Infinity War. Treyarch, Infinity War, so. I can't lie, MW2. MW2, oh man, this game MW2 was toxic as shit. Overall, I feel like, <laughs> overall experience wise, it it just compared, like, nothing compared to it in terms of, like, game chat and, like, overall community. Yeah, but, I felt like, um, I felt like the game was good. It started the streak. Okay, fixing yeah, myself. It started much. the streak system. But the game was very toxic. I'm not gonna lie. Like One man army noob, noob tube. Um, what else? Command. Yep. Commando pro. Remember that. You get knifed across the entire map. Um, Lunge on one trillion. But I mean, uh, guns were pretty good. I mean, I don't know. Like maps were pretty good. Uh. I'll put it on A just because how toxic it was. I'm not gonna lie. It was very toxic. Noob tubes were damn near. I don't know. It was crazy as fuck. But um, all right. Bo one. No, Bo one. You already started heard. zombies, bro. I'm not gonna lie. This game started zombies and paved the way for it. Well, it didn't start. It didn't start zombies, but it popped it off really well, bro. Like. People, okay, so World War Zombies, was it was the, it was mid. That's when we got the good zombies map. It was mid, but Kino, Der Toten, bro, like for a starting map, and then I don't know if like y'all ever played the DLC maps for it, but it was from pretty good DLC maps. Uh, um, there was not really nothing toxic about BO1. I mean, you could, you know, like there was not really anything super toxic about B01. I mean, it just felt had balanced really good, to me. Had a really good like, uh, like rank system. Had like the cop points. You know, yep. not the cop points we're talking about today. Yeah, we ain't copping no blueprints in B01. The but. other cop <laughs> points from what was it? League play back then. Still? I'm pretty sure. 
But you already know that you already know that boy S tier. Yeah, I'll put that on S. It was it was a very good game. Okay. Status, MW3. MW3. Oh man, this is a hard one. This is a hard one. I'm not gonna lie. MW3, MW3 wasn't my most favorite. It it wasn't my most favorite either. It was pretty toxic. No, it was it wasn't really toxic, but LMG spawn trapping was pretty toxic. Um what else? Uh, I did kind of like the guns. They gave you some good starting guns. Like a lot of these CODs right here, you started off with terrible guns. Like I'm not gonna lie to you. Like especially BO1, you started off with bad guns. Like they gave you bad guns, but the game's still good. But um, this game has some good starting weapons. Uh, added a, some guns from MW2. I still don't think the MW3 ACR was better than MW2 ACR, but you know, that's my opinion. Um, that's map map wise, I don't think it's better than MW2 map wise. But I felt like streaks was pretty cool. Support streaks was kind of annoying. Uh I'm throwing it in B tier personally. You can make the final decision. Hey, we're, we're gonna go over it at the end. Um, I'll just put it on B for now. We're just gonna redo it, re go over it. Alright, um, let's see. Uh, what was next? Uh, after MJ3, it was BO2. BO2. Oh man. Here, throw that mug. Get down. Okay, okay, okay. So, look, listen, listen. I would say S tier, and I would put it on S tier, but a lot of people would put it on S tier too. But I think a lot of people overhyped, overhyped it and never even played BO2. Like to be honest with you, BO2 is a hard game. Let's well, not get me wrong, but the like, I personally, I actually play zombies, and the first map on zombies sucked to me. Man, but it is crazy. but. One of the best maps ever. One of one of the best guns you could use. It was toxic a little bit when it comes to target fighter hey, LMGs, but hey, show them the gun. Hey, the gun right here. What? The gun for editing, my guy. Oh like yeah, 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 yeah. I, I got that. I got you. I got you. I'm gonna put some gameplay in the middle, like some like I'm gonna be playing the cards, but um. Yeah, I, I, I mean, it's S tier, I mean, but don't, I wouldn't say, like, if you didn't play this COD, bro, and you just going off opinion, like, oh, BO2 is the best COD, and you never really played the COD, bro, stop saying it's the best COD, like, yeah, you don't, you, you don't, don't know. Got, if you don't got 30 days in that motherfucker, you can't <laughs> say it, no. but, but look, okay, uh, yeah, that COD was going stupid. Okay, so now we got Ghost, man. This is very controversial. This is very controversial. A very controversial call. Ghost is at least this is another. This people would say Ghost was F tier, but look, Ghost gotta at least go in A. This is this is what I would say. A lot of people didn't play Ghost. Y'all just got off YouTubers and hopped on a hype train to where YouTubers hopped on another hype train to where saying that Ghost was bad, right? It's super terrible. I don't even think it was super terrible. It wasn't even close to that. Like. Uh, it, the guns felt good, like guns would slay, you know. Uh, I had like 17. The streaks were trash, not gonna lie. But the game has some decent maps. It had some trash maps, but it had some good maps, bro. And they some had decent maps and some decent guns. Yeah, like some maps were bad, I'm not gonna lie. Like Whiteout and Stormfront, the maps were terrible oh, and shit. But in Stonehaven. <laughs> but. Whoa, but the honey badger just felt like a lot of guns just felt like you were actually shooting a gun like and then the streaks weren't that well but some streaks were good like the battle hind the, the maniac like that's like and that maniac was something different like it was a different type of juggernaut like i like that too and extinction extinction was cool to me I, it, was cool. it was cool it was cool it had a real objective to it uh it was like something different aliens instead of zombies at least they you know change it up so um a strong a a yeah uh i'm gonna put on b for now 
Just for that. That's, that's a strong A for me. Okay. Personally, but what's next? Okay. B O three. B O three. Yes. Okay. This I ain't gonna lie. Game had okay. My opinion. My opinion. Game had the best zombies ever. A W coach. A W. Yeah, 2014. Oh, yeah, yeah, 2014, 2014, 2014. You're right. Hey, Sorry about like, that. Sorry about that. Yeah, All right. Hey, Advanced Warfare. Mm. Ugh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, so the game was decent. Like, ranked, ranked, ranked was fine. Uh, ranked was actually pretty good. Ranked was good. I felt like I could hit my shots. I like the snipers. Uh, Exo Survival was okay. Maps was all right. Yeah. What drug it down was the motherfucking variant. But what the drug the game the down very like what what made the game very bad was the elite variants and how pay to win it was. Elite. Like you could spend like a bunch of money on you know elite supply drops and have the elite, most elite five hundred dollars. Let's later. not let's not forget about let's not forget about the uh, HVR insanity, the fucking. Uh, Val of City and Steed, like, and some people would never even have shit like that. Like, it was crazy. Like, and then, and then this would put the icing on the shit cake. You could use them in rank play. That's what yep. threw it off so bad. Like, that's what that's what threw me off. Uh, I didn't like how Exo Zombies you had to pay for the first map. Like, they should just made Exo Zombies the first that thing instead of money pit. instead of Exo Survival. Yeah, but um. Otherwise, other than that, I mean, I felt like, I felt like, um, ranked was pretty cool. My shots hit, like, I felt like my, I was actually hitting shots besides like, you know, Treyarch games, you know, it's a, <laughs> you shoot at somebody and your bullets would travel. Like, I don't know. It's just, I don't know. You just have to see it for yourself, but, uh, I'll put it on C. I think C is a... I think C's a uh, cool place for it. C tier really a deserving. Yeah. All right. So. Uh, BO3. BO3. Oh, man. Oh, man. I I love this COD, bro. I'm not going to lie to you. This COD, mm -hmm. this game was pay to win at the end of the game. Like, near the end. Like, in the middle yeah, and bro, near the just, end. Like, we just going to bring cosmetics. Mm-hmm. But, um. Um, I think zombie. I think BO3 zombies was one of the best zombies. Like, in my opinion, like there's BO3 zombies had to. So you were saying World at War it started it off. It was mid zombies was mid. BO1 zombies was pretty good. Uh, Kino was a real good map for a starting map. Uh, DLC maps pretty decent. Uh, BO2 zombies I didn't really like it that much. They had two good maps in my opinion. And those were DLC maps, but um, BL3, the first map, Shadows of Evil, it was so perfectly designed, like it, it like threw everybody off loop, like it wasn't the same characters, like it was just, it was just real good. And multiplayer was just like all vibrant. It just felt like I was playing like, you know, a real Treyarch game again. Um, yeah, but I think I felt like Treyarch went free for in this but bo3 i gotta give it the strong a and they had a rank they had a rank play too so yeah i'll yeah. i'll put it on that so i ain't gonna lie bo3 up there and it's stuck there yeah um what was that there be out there uh, infinite warfare infinite warfare IW. Oh man. Okay. So, my opinion on Infinite Warfare. Actually, what's your opinion on Infinite Warfare? You, it's your uh, turn. I used to play freaking IW. Uh, good opinion. You know what I'm saying? Uh, maps was okay. Now they had some crazy, some crazy OP guns. They had a sniper that you could use like a shotgun. You know what I'm saying? That boy was stupid. <laughs> And then I had this VPR, a SMG with mad long range and no recoil at all. <laughs> you gun gun any AR, any NV4, free patch, free patch uh MPR was MV whatever it's called. It, it was crazy. 
Yeah. But overall, the game was a the game was a spinoff of Bo3. To be honest, yeah, it was mad. It was mad lazy. It wasn't executed the best. I don't know. Soft perspective. Yeah. I think it's a, I think it's a solid B tier game, if not. And it, it didn't feel like it was like the game. It, it, it felt like Titanfall, my God. Yeah, Titanfall. it felt like Titanfall. I feel like the when they added, um, when they added the what is that shit called? The specialists. I feel like the specialists weren't even that good. You know, it, the game looked boring to me. And then they copied Black Scott. They copied Dark Matter. Like, I don't know. <sighs> What you think? C. See? Yeah. C tier with his brother, AW. Alright, okay. Alright, um. What's. BL4? World at War? No, World at War, right? Uh, wait, so. IW's Infinite. Or IW. IW is 2017. 16. 16. And then 17. World at War is 2017. World War Two was seventeen. Yeah. Okay. So, oh man. Man, throw that game in a motherfucking trash can. This game was super Personally. busted. The maps were terrible, in my opinion. Uh, except for a couple. There was like three good maps, but or two. It was like really OP terrible. shotguns. The shotguns were OP. Sniping was very easy. It didn't take really any skill to snipe. Um. Like I said, game was game was pay to win. Uh, I feel like the mastery camo wasn't even all that. Um, you know, it just gameplay felt like a bare bones guy. Yeah, but it really didn't hold up for its time. The movement didn't even feel right either. They did. They took slot. They took sliding out of this game also. Like you had, it was dolphin diving in this game. Like you know how I feel about dolphin diving. Like that's just Throw that shit's terrible. F tier personally for its prime. I really didn't think that game was a good game. No. It it still don't hold up to this day. No, I can't I can't I honestly I can't go back and play it. Like I can go back and play it like a couple games, but I yeah, just yeah, not I'm not gonna have fun. Boring, mad quick. So. Yeah. Alright, uh And then we got twenty eighteen. Twenty eighteen was uh Black Ops four. four. Mm-hmm. Mm, I the game was good, decent maps, decent guns, decent streaks, but me personally, I hate it where you had to manually heal yourself. Yeah, I didn't like that either. There was no automatic healing. Yeah. I feel like the streaks were really good in this game, though. Absolutely. The streaks, the streaks are really OP. Like, the Thresher, the Strike Team, the Drone Squad was even OP. Like, the streaks are really good. Like, you earned, like, you really got what you got out of your streaks like even the the sniper's nest went ape shit like um, they had blackout yeah blackout yeah blackout was a plus too uh but again again the game was pay to win pay to it, it was pay to win uh zombies maps they didn't really live up to potential except nine nine was pretty good but blood of the dead and and uh, Voyage of Despair wasn't really all that, so I just put it on C. But the multiplayer did have potential, and they did start Blackout. So, uh, okay. Modern Warfare 2019. <sighs> what? Mm, I need your opinion okay. on this. I need your opinion on this. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go back in the I'm gonna go back in the bookshelf for memories in my mind. Uh, MW 2019. Sure. Solid game. I like the guns. Maps is weird to me personally. Mm -hmm. Uh, other than that, I think it was a solid game. You know, it wasn't like the best, but it wasn't by any means a terrible game at all. Time to kill was good. Game yeah. Chat, game chat was pretty active. Mm -hmm. Had a you know decent community around it. Yeah. Um, definitely a big step up from freaking. What was it? Bl4. I'm talking about Infinity Wars the last. Oh, uh, Infinite War. Or yeah, Infinite Warfare. Yeah, Infinite Warfare. Definitely a big step up from that. Yeah. For, for sure. a fact. 
I, uh, yeah, I, uh, okay. I think, uh, okay, so I think the maps were terrible. They didn't have any good map. Like, let's be honest with you. None of their maps were good, bro. They had to, they, they lived off, um, search. They literally lived off search and destroy and they lived off, uh, yeah, all they, all they maps was geared for search. Yeah. All of them. And they, and they lived off remakes. Like all they did was remake maps for like people mainly play shipment and shoe house and, and vacant and like the maps that they brought back like the dudes didn't really play like regular team deathmatch and shit because didn't nobody want to play on piccadilly team deathmatch like that shit was terrible um i felt like the whole blueprint system and stuff like that and how the game wasn't pay to win anymore like you could actually like do a challenge to get the gun i felt like that was cool as shit uh like you you actually did a challenge and you can actually unlock the op weapon that i like that mechanic um damascus the mastery camo was bad i ain't gonna lie that shit was terrible it was it was it was okay but it, like if it would have moved or something that would have been cool like we had we we're getting off cods where there was camos that are reactive like like uh black ops 4 when it had um dark matter and it like spikes would pop out if you kill somebody or bo3 like dark matter or like you know you know stuff like that but uh you know uh, i just didn't like the mastery camos gold was gold even looked weird i don't know why it looked like a camo i don't know what it was bro but nah uh, i don't know uh <laughs> Search Search was really lit in this game and Game Child is real active. Um maps were terrible. But they did bring back a lot of good maps. It kinda saved the game. A bit. Oh, and Warzone, Warzone, where are we, where are we forgetting? Warzone, so Warzone blew up the game a lot. So I'll put this on B. I'm not gonna lie. I'll put it's definitely better than AW and uh, IW, so yeah, yeah B tier. Yeah, I'll put that on B. Ooh, I don't know how to feel about this card, bro. Cold War. All right. Cold War. I liked it more as I liked it more as time went on, but initially I really didn't. Um, yeah, I didn't like it in the start. It just felt yeah, the maps better. were bad. I'm not gonna lie. Like um, Moscow, Miami. Like, dog, no, people were not playing on those maps. Like I said, this is another COD. This is another COD like this COD to where. When they had to bring out maps and search really saved the game too. Uh, when they bring brought out maps, it was really like you know, it was really like that you know. So like you know, people play Newtown and all that shit and slums and all that shit. This is near the end of the game though, or no? They brought Newtown in the middle of the game and then they started to add more. But uh, zombies, like the first map, it was it was cool, it was cool, but it was it was a little easy. Not gonna lie, like anybody can play that shit. Um, I don't know. Oh uh, they... yeah, zombies was mad easy. Mhm. Mm like how you could just die with your weapons and you come back with them, or uh, what else was easy about it? It was something else that was real easy. Oh right, yeah, you start off with your own gun. That's another thing. You could use whatever gun you want to use, and like you could upgrade it in multiplayer. I like that actually. You can play zombies and upgrade your gun through zombies and have it upgraded in the multiplayer. And then they had a, a their camos, their dark matter was really good, but all they did was copy dark matter from BL3. That's really all it was. But it was it was it looked good. I mean, multiplayer dark matter looked a little different from BL3. Uh, dark matter, but zombies BL3, zombies dark matter was the same as BL3's multiplayer. But uh, campaign was okay. I didn't like how your character didn't talk. Um, mm, I'll put it. I I'll put it right there. It, it was damn near the same as Modern Warfare. It just was more vibrant. I'm giving it. I like MW better, so I give it. I'm giving it personally a, a high C, but you you give it a B, so that pulls it up to B. So I guess B is where it's gonna sit. Yeah. Okay. So Vanguard, Vanguard is out currently right now. Um, 
personal thoughts on the game is freaking boring. Boring? Sorry. Hate it. Uh, no, it's not it's not that bad of a game overall. Uh you got some guns that they definitely need to be uh patched for sure. Nerfed a little little bit. Shotguns they are I mean they need to be touched. Yeah. Maps Maps was uh Maps are okay. I our maps are alright. Um you know, Das Hall's shotgun central shipment mm -hmm. shotgun central and lmg central other than that all the other like multiplayer maps aren't terrible they you know what i'm saying they're already thus far yeah i uh actually need a wow factor and something though like some some got to give yeah right um i think the game is pretty cool zombies is absolutely freaking oh yeah zombies is zombies garbage. is terrible and you, I can vouch. Multiple people can vouch. Like I'm not, but I actually played it. It's not not good at all. It's literally the map is literally a multiplayer map, and they just cut a they cut the middle of the map and just made it the zombies map. Like I don't like how that's laziness. I don't like that laziness in like zombies. But Maybe. multiplayer is okay. I like the camos. The mo the the mastery camo is basically Damascus, but moves and it's a different color. For me, that game sits out a solid C. C. Hot. Yeah, like a solid C for me. You think it's on par with Infinite Warfare, though? Infinite Warfare is a bit better than it. What? Personally. Uh, I think I'll put it on a B. I'm not gonna lie to you. It it feels like it has a lot of potential. Once they patch a lot of shit, they're gonna add a bunch of maps and well, shit. Yeah, it, it is still new. It's, it's still in process. Give, so. We do gotta give it. We do gotta give it some time. You know, COD don't like to release finished games nowadays, but it's okay. Okay, so now we're going. Oh, here's Michi's Twitter link, by the way. I don't know why it popped up, but there's Michi's Twitter. You know, um, uh. Well, what do you think? Does anything well, need to be overall, changed? Let's see. Overall, Ghost was hard though. It wasn't, but it wasn't COD Four MW too hard. Yeah. Okay. So this. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. So I'm. I think I'm going to put. You can throw COD 4 and B. I mean, it was bare bones. What are we talking about for the time? Or what? Or you can throw COD 4, but I think COD 4 was so good because at the time, bro, like, there was no shooter games like that. I mean, you had to like, CSGO and stuff. Yeah. But in 2007, bro, COD 4 was hitting the marks. I'm not going to lie. As of today, though, COD 4 don't hold up, obviously, but. Yeah. Uh, I think this list is pretty good. I think this list. Yeah, is this list is solid. this is dang near the best list in my opinion. Like, we got BO1, BO2, BO3, like damn near, damn near the best cods out. Let's be honest. I mean, they're Treyarch games. Uh, I played every single one of these games, but um, a lot of people are gonna say MW2 can touch the S tier too, but personally, MW2 wasn't all that. It wasn't. It wasn't as good as Black Ops games to me. Yeah, it it it, it really wasn't. Like I'm gonna keep it but a it buck. Was it was it was a good ass game. Not gonna lie, but at the same time, the game was very unplayable at a certain point. So, mm -hmm. um. But yeah, other than that, this Kai this four. Looks, yeah, this looks look damn solid to me. Mm-hmm. World at War, uh, I think I'll put World at War up here, I'm not gonna lie. World at War was hard. Yeah, it, 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 it and if I, I can literally go back and play World at War and it's gonna be fun as shit. Like, especially if you play with somebody, bro, like, the game's gonna be fun, bro. But, um, yeah, I, I think this is, this is pretty accurate. Uh, NW3, I agree. um, you know. Yeah, this is pretty good. But uh Well, thanks for watching. Um make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Michi's Twitter is right here. Uh 
If you want his YouTube, I got his link in bio or his link in the description. Uh, yes, I'll see you in the next one.